brought me to a place in which those who were there were like flaming fire. And when they wished, they appeared as men. And they brought me to the place of darkness, and to a mountain, the point of whose summit reached to heaven. And I saw the places of the luminaries, and the treasuries of the stars, and of the thunder, and in the uttermost depths, where were a fiery bow and arrows, and their quiver, and a fiery sword, and all the lightnings. And they took me to the living waters, and to the fire of the west, which receives every setting of the sun. And I came to a river of fire, in which the fire flows like water, and discharges itself into the great sea towards the west. And I saw the great rivers, and came to the great river, and to the great darkness, and went to the place where no flesh walks. And I saw the mountains of the darkness of winter, and the place whence all the waters of the deep flow. I saw the mouths of the rivers of the earth, and the mouth of the deep. I saw the treasuries of all the winds. I saw how he had furnished with them the whole creation, and the firm foundations of the earth. And I saw the cornerstone of the earth. I saw the four winds which bear the earth, and the firmament of heaven. And I saw how the winds stretch out the vaults of heaven, and have their station between heaven and earth. These are the pillars of the heaven. And I saw the winds of heaven which turn, and bring the circumference of the sun, and all the stars to their setting. I saw the winds on the earth carrying the clouds. I saw the paths of the angels. I saw at the end of the earth the firmament of the heaven above. And I proceeded and saw a place which burns day and night, where there are seven mountains of magnificent stones, three towards the east and three towards the south. And as for those towards the east, one was of colored stone and one of pearl and one of jason, and those towards the south of redstone but the middle one reached to heaven, like the throne of God, of alabaster, and the summit of the throne was of sapphire. And I saw a flaming fire, and beyond these mountains is a region, the end of the great earth. There the heavens were completed. And I saw a deep abyss, with columns of heavenly fire, and among them I saw columns of fire fall, which were beyond measure, alight towards the height and towards the depth. And beyond that abyss I saw a place which had no firmament of the heaven above, and no firmly founded earth beneath it. There was no water upon it, and no birds, but it was a waste and horrible place. I saw there seven stars like great burning mountains, and to me, when I inquired regarding them, the angel said, This is the end of heaven and earth. This has become a prison for the stars and the host of heaven. And the stars which roll over the fire are they which have transgressed the commandments of the Lord in the beginning of their rising, because they did not come forth at their appointed times. And he was wroth with them, and bound them till the time when their guilt should be consummated, even for ten thousand years. And Uriel said to me, Here shall stand the angels who have connected themselves with women, and their spirits, assuming many different forms, are defiling mankind, and shall lead them astray into sacrificing to demons as gods. Here shall they stand, till the day of the great judgment in which they shall be judged, till they are made an end of. And the women also the angels who went astray shall become sirens. And I, Enoch, alone saw the vision, the end of all things, and no man shall see as I have seen.